What is up everyone, my name is Exceptional and today we're looking at the Type 63 Tactical Rifle. The Type 63 is actually the nephew of the DMR. Basically it does the same thing, only the DMR has barely any recoil and the Type 63 does, but the Type 63 has better damage. Hey, I'm gonna be honest to you guys, I'm not gonna say that the Type 63 is better than the DMR, because it's not. The DMR doesn't move at all and the time to kill is basically the same. But what I will say to you is that whenever the DMR gets nerfed, there's a high chance and probability that the Type 63 can replace the DMR. So in this video, I'm going to show you guys the best Type 63 class setup and it is not as simple as I thought it was. I tried to copy the DMR setup onto the Type 63 setup and I thought that would probably work, but it didn't at all. So I had to do some testing and I changed it up a bit. And this Type 63 is actually way better than the DMR setup. And after the class setup, I have some great gameplay with the Type 63. So stick around for that as well. But before we go into the class setup, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like, it will help me out a lot. And if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing as well. Let's go into the Type 63 class setup. The first attachment we're using is the Gru Silencer. Basically, the monolithic suppressor gives you sound suppression and extra damage range. Very easy choice. After that, this might come as a surprise. Everybody's using the titanium barrel on the DMR, but it is not that great on the Type 63, just because the high fire rate will give you more recoil. And with the high fire rate, the Type 63 is uncontrollable. So I went with the strike team barrel. This will give you a fire rate increase as well, but not as much as the titanium, but it gives you some extra damage. This is, in my opinion, the go-to barrel. After that, I'm using the Fission Tech 2 times scope. This is the best scope for recoil control. This will increase your recoil control a bit more than the rest of the scopes. After that, I went for the Spetsnaz grip. This will give you vertical and horizontal the recoil control. This is very good for the Type 63. This will make the recoil a lot less. And last but not least, we're using the speed tape. This will increase your ADS speed. We're not using the 30 round Mac because it already has 25 as a base weapon. And I don't think the five bullets make that much of a difference. So this is the Type 63 class setup. I really did enjoy it. It, it does hit really hard, but just compared to the DMR, it's just a little less good. The DMR is just insanely overpowered right now. It is a challenging weapon. It has a lot of recoil. But if you hit your shots, it is really deadly, just like a DMR is. So try it out yourself and let me know if you liked it or not. And now let's get into the gameplay. I hope you guys enjoy. There's more. Testing gave me some mixed results, so I... My stuff. Hostile drop in the air. Got the drop bag inbound. Marking you safe zone. Good. Bounty target is down. Well done. I can't play like that, you know? What happened in your life that you need to play like that? Bro, what the hell? UAV beginning flyover. Good. Oh my god, this lobby is dead. That's a dead lobby. UAV is out of fuel. 
fuel. Returning to resupply. Good, 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 good. I know he's underneath. I'm gonna go okay. there, one over there, I'm gonna kill and all of them over here. Oh my god, no, really, one camping dude, always the same sh Good, good. All right, let's get this party started, man. Come on. Rico's a little bit much compared to... I think you need to be a little bit more controlled with these shots. Alright, he's still... he's there. He's up there probably, or in there. UAV is out of fuel. Returning to resupply. Yeah, remember me? Good, good, good. That was probably... Did I win against a DMR? Oh, that's not even a DMR. Thing is... Look how hard it hits. Not him. Not him.
Oh no, and a DMI.